London, a section of State Street was shut down as firefighters from several area fire departments battled a fire. It happened in a building with more than a dozen rental units and two businesses. News 8 got a look inside that charred building today. Aaron Logan joins us live in our New Haven newsroom with what firefighters had to say. Aaron? And Darren, putting out this fire was a bit challenging. Two of the firefighters had to go to the hospital for smoke inhalation. But the good news, everybody got out of the homes and businesses safely. And we were even there for a special moment that put a smile on many faces. Now, a pet owner's day got a little better in this awful situation as firefighters found a cat in one of the 18 units a few hours after the blaze started. Extreme heat on the fourth floor was just one of the many challenges firefighters faced inside this building, where two businesses occupy the first floor. You can see they are a mess. New London firefighters showed us inside the upstairs units where false multi-layered walls made their jobs difficult. Fire Chief Henry Kidd says the firefighters later realized the fire had made its way to the rear section of the building, which had three layers of roofing materials. These buildings are 80 plus years old, and what happens is every time they do a re refit, they just put sheetrock over what was there, make it look good, and now we, we have all these void spaces that we have to you know, go through. Now, firefighters spent most of the day trying to take that roof down. Their cause of the fire is still under investigation. Live in the New Haven newsroom, Aaron Logan, back to you in the studio.